So today guys, we're gonna be uh, actually working on the car instead of, you know, just filming it and stuff and just talking about uh, some nonsense, I guess. I'm gonna be changing up my brake pads because uh, they're starting to wear out because they're, the car is used no, and Super's not gonna change them, obviously. So today, we're gonna be doing that and yeah, hope you guys like it. I'm here with my father. You could've given me a heads up, man. What do you mean? You know I'm always gonna be filming. Look at his hat. Daddy. Yeah, these are the, the front ones. You changing both? Yeah, I'm changing both. I mean, I, I got both of them, might as well, right? They were pretty cheap, honestly. I mean, I couldn't find, it was hard to find uh, like, uh, like rear brake pads. Mm -hmm. and I was like, fucking, I was searching for like three, like almost like a week or two. Are you, from over are, here. are you supposed to rip the box? No, bitch. <laughs> right down here, look. Damn, look, look at the schmeat on that, bro. It's heavy. These are these are kind of normal. These are a little bit bigger than you know the average ones, but everybody's size does matter. <laughs> Ain't that right? Ironic of you to say that. Yeah. Uh, these aren't bad, huh? No. They were pretty cheap, honestly. Let's hope your car stops squeaking. Let's see a problem. Yeah, uh, that's that's one reason why I decided to change the, um, the rear brake pad so soon because I mean the uh, the brake pads on the rear are pretty good. This there's a lot of meat on there, but it was just squeaking so much and it was just getting so annoying. So bought these, might as well just change out the front because the front ones are probably gonna be they're probably gonna be probably gonna need to change them pretty soon, anyways. So, we don't have the best equipment, but we're working with what we got. You guys want to make donations? We we'll take donations. Send it our way. Yeah. And it's at the point where he doesn't want to do anything. Mm -hmm. So, changing the brake pads on the SCI, it's like the easiest I've ever had to do. Because on the normal cars, you just have to like pop up the caliper and just, you know, swap out the brake pads. But with uh, the Brembo kits on the STI, all you gotta do is just pop these pins out and then just take this metal plate out and then get a, a flathead and just pop it up, so. And then, I don't know where to get this at. I just stole it from work, so. And then, originally, when you when you buy these the brake pads, you can um, you can get the hardware too. But I couldn't find the hardware anywhere, so we're just gonna be reusing what we have. Uh, bam! Literally, it's just easy like that. Just super easy. Look at that. Bam. Pops right off. Pops right off. And then, you know, they still have some uh, some meat on these, but he's been squeaking way too much, so I can't handle it. Bam. So I learned this at uh, on a video online. So you gotta, I guess you gotta pry, it. just push the piston back, and I guess there's a tool for it. But all you gotta do is just get the old one and just pry it out. There you go. What you using there? Huh? What you using there? Lubricant. You gotta always lube it up. What are you talking about? Talking about the brakes, man. Always gotta lube it up. Can't open this. What's the point of going to the gym if you can't even open brake lube? That's the thing, we haven't been going to the gym. So we're gonna grab some of this lube. Lube up the back. Put a nice amount. Can't be can't skimp out. Then got to lube up the sides. Now you could get this lube at AutoZone, so it's pretty cheap. AutoZone, you go. You get anything at AutoZone. You could get hood scoops. 
exhausts. Forgot to tell him every hood scoop is 15 horsepower extra. Ah, I thought it was 20. No, that's O'Reilly. That's O'Reilly. <laughs> okay, and then you just pop it right in, just like that. Bam, super easy. Go through. So you do the same thing for the other side. Just try not to make, just make sure not to get a, any of the lubricant on the actual, on the actual pad itself, because then you won't be able to stop and you're gonna die. And if you die? Then you won't be alive. To buy car parts. To buy car parts. There you go. That's, that's the only reason why God put me in this world. To buy car parts? To buy car parts, fuck up cars, and eat some za. You started off with the good car, your Nissan Sentra Nismo? My Nissan Sentra Nismo edition. I was gonna do the STI conversion, but it was too expensive, so I just went for a normal STI. Should have put a 2JZ in there, man. On my STI? On my Sentra? Yeah. My STI Sentra? Yeah. You make. You make great money being an idiot. You're doing it right now for free, so. I hate you, you treat me so harshly. Just like that. Bam, easy. One of the... Mr. Muscle over here with this checkered vans. You recording me, man? Yeah, no, I, I wasn't distracted by that little pedal. Hey, send me a piece of that corn. You need help? S send me a piece of that corn for later. All right, you guys. So we're taking um, maintenance advice from a guy. Excuse me, excuse me. So rule number I one. I just realized. Whenever you put the tire back on and the rim, you gotta make sure you remove the jack first. You didn't tell me. Come on, Mr. Movie Star. Uh, you guys don't follow my, my advice. Like I said in the previous videos, I really don't know what I'm doing. Over again. So the same concept on this side. It's just the difference with this one is the metal rod, so uh, we use a 13 millimeter socket to get it out. And WD-40. And WD-40. So, same thing, punch these pins out. Up there. We we'll were using that. Then. So the next step was just to push out the rod right in between. And uh, same thing as the other ones, just get the flat head and try to squeeze it out. Hopefully I don't mess up my... And put all your bloopers in there. Make it look like an idiot. Make me look like you, you mean, right? I'm done then. You remember when you opened that, the door for that girl in high school? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jeez, man. I don't I know, know how what you, I was doing. I don't know how you managed to mess up something that bad. It's it was just, pretty bad. <laughs> it's just opening a door and... I'm not good at opening doors. <laughs> yeah, well... It's good memories for us. Dude, I was, so, I was so nervous. I don't know what I was doing. Dude, you literally just had to open a door. Dude, I was, I was so nervous. Man. You butchered the song. Did I? Yeah. Bam. Oh, these are actually Brembo brakes. Really? Yeah, look. I don't know why Subaru just doesn't put AutoZone brakes on them. It's getting cold. Alright, so... I mean, it would help if you wore a shirt. Just lube it up. Front. I mean, the back and the sides. And it should be good to go. It took a while. It's getting dark. It's like fucking fire. But uh, we got it in. Next thing, put back this, this rod right down the middle first. There we go. 
Like who showed up? Just learning as we go. Oh no way! It's the guy with the two Jay Z, one one Jay Z. What's up, man? What's up, bro? Hey, what kind of uh, engine are you running? Uh, F twenty four two Jay Z. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna swap out that transmission. Uh, put a four speeder. <laughs> uh, I need some new rims too, cause they hijacked me other ones. <laughs> Motherfucker, man. <laughs> Look at my hands. He's normally like that. Yeah, I don't shower. No. I don't even wear shirts. <laughs> my knees cracked. He got firecrackers for knees. Wait, 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 let me help. Teach him right. Narcos? Uh, I finished the Escobar one. Yeah, the you finished it? Yeah, the Escobar. Ooh, it's crazy, limon. huh? El limon. <laughs> El limon got fucked yeah, over, bro. El limon got annihilated. Y los a esos malparidos que si me quitan la plata. Plata o plomo. I like that. Hijo de su gran puta madre. El limon was just there like... <laughs> si, jefe. <laughs> Le agarro sus cueritos. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Limon got fucking wrecked. <laughs> he was going up the stairs. Limon got annihilated. <laughs> Did you see that game? On the app store of Narcos? You no. can get a level 900 Limon. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Limon. Level 900. <laughs> He's just walking with the pistol. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, damn. <laughs> Fucking limon, bro. It was dirty. He did that that girl dirty as fuck. Oh, the because he was nice at first. Yeah. Then he became a little prick. We didn't get greasy saw. How do you feel about that? It's okay. Chick Fil A is good. Yeah, but we waited like 40 minutes to get it. It's okay. Overall, I got it got dark, so we couldn't really finish. Oh, well, we finished the brakes, but I didn't really see. Um, it was pretty easy install for some for the Brembo brakes, and then tomorrow I'm gonna be going to a Canyon Run again, uh, New Year's Eve Canyon Run. So 
I'll bring you guys along and then this video will probably be posted up sometime on Saturday or Sunday and then the canyon run probably lies on Tuesday. So hopefully uh, it was informative and stuff so you didn't I, even talk. I mean yeah I did. Let him do his outro. I, I hate you guys. <laughs> but yeah, peace out guys. Go ahead, subscribe, leave a comment. If you found it helpful, follow me on Instagram. Alright, peace out.